Hello guys, it's your boy Code for Speed again, coming back to you guys with another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be demonstrating you guys on five reasons why you should own the 2023 Kona inline uh, vehicle. Um, before I get into any major details, if you guys wanna know where this vehicle is located, it's Dixon City Hyundai. Um, the link will be in the description. I wanna also thank Dixon City Hyundai for letting me use these vehicles um, for reviews and just doing videos on these vehicles because it's really appreciated. Um, the link will be down in the description and before I get into any major details please make sure that you like comment and subscribe to the channel just so you'll be the first ones upload uh, alert for my newest uploads um, and let's get right into the vehicle uh, as you guys may know this vehicle is being posted in 2022 but I have a 2023 Hyundai Kona sitting in front of me so let me tell you guys the first reason why you guys should own this vehicle is the look like this <laughs> it gives it uh, I say it's comparable to the Mini Cooper and the Kia Soul um, those are going to be my two things that I say come close to this vehicle or a bigger Kia Rio, you know, um, but this gives it more of a, uh, how do I say that, a more a uh, aerodynamic, sportier look. Um, I mean, you have the two-piece tips right here at the bottom, which is pretty cool right there. Um, I really love how the extra lights are planted right up under the uh, Kona emblem, literally face down with a curve into the vehicle. Uh, what let's see this vehicle uh, has Eagle touring tires equipped on it um, and they're size 18s uh, 235 45 by 18s um, vehicle has the racks across and then the inline just <laughs> Hyundai uh, did magnificent with that so that's gonna be your first reason why I, I, I think you guys showing this vehicle if you're looking for a nice cheap well-maintained vehicle the inline gives it that more sportier look and the lights are actually on but you don't really notice it <laughs> so your second reason why you own this vehicle is the warranty i mean uh, the warranty that hyundai has on these new vehicles are fantastic i mean let's let's go over it together so you guys can see um just because many people don't really look but you have a five year sixty thousand mile new vehicle warranty you have a 10 year hundred thousand mile powertrain warranty have a seven year unlimited anti proportion -per whatever warranty have a three year 36 complimentary warranty and you have a five year unlimited mile roadside assistance and I'm, i meant to say seven unlimited mile anti peripheral whatever or it is um on a vehicle which i mean that's about five different warranties that you have on the brand new car so i mean what is there to worry about other than making a payment or if you pay cash you're paying cash for the vehicle uh, so they're going to be your two reasons looks warranty and third this vehicle is all-wheel drive so i live in uh in epa and that's something that many uh of us look for when you're buying a vehicle I'm not saying you can't drive the vehicle in the snow but just to have that that extra advantage which all-wheel drive lock here there is that there is that option to have the all-wheel drive lock there so if you're stuck in snow or you don't have anyone to shovel you out or just the snow's too big too clunks and you need that all-wheel drive i mean it's a really great thing to have you know most people say they can deal without it if you don't really drive in the snow then it's not really something that you should be uh interested in getting but if you do drive in the snow a lot and you want that little bit of extra safety uh all-wheel drive is something that i would consider having uh when you purchase this vehicle um not saying that you need it if you don't drive it a lot in the snow if you don't drive a lot in the snow there's no purpose in getting it just to pay for it for not having it you see what i'm saying for not using it my apologies but if you're gonna use it uh make sure you pay for what you use you know um so that's your third reason that you do have an option to get this vehicle in all-wheel drive um so you can save um or your mpgs as well uh if you get the all-wheel drive i mean your mpgs go down a little bit but not much you know uh, but that's what that's what i was going to go to your fourth reason why i show on this vehicle this vehicle gets 29 combined highway and city miles uh 27 city 32 highway i commute about 20 miles a day to work so i would have an extra i take the highway so i'd have an extra 12 miles of traveling on this vehicle which is perfect especially let's say i gotta travel through the snow to get to work or i, I or i can't make it and i only gotta like just to have that extra bit miles per gallon so right now i do have another car that averages 18 miles per gallon so just to have uh 27 to 32 which is something that is perfect on this vehicle your fifth reason why you guys should own this vehicle is the features um 
When I first sat in this vehicle, I noticed that I was really comfortable, which I have a lot of headroom, but I also have a sunroof right here. So if I want to pop that bad boy open, you know, especially in the, um, in the summer when it's really hot and you don't want to use all your AC, literally pop this bad boy open and you got a sunroof, you know. Um, this vehicle also has highway driving assist and lane keep assist, which are things that I love. Both right there, when they're that color, that's when they activate it. Um, the reason, the real, the real reason on why I love them is because when I'm driving on the highway, sometimes I have to reach down for my phone, or sometimes when, uh, I take my eyes off the road for about two seconds, and just to have that feature uh, would just know that I, I, I have a little bit of safety. If I like, if I'm have my phone like this and I got to reach down, take my eyes, this vehicle still will keep me in both lanes of the highway while I'm driving. Uh, another thing I really love is your uh, blind spot detection, which I have in my side mirrors. It would alert me if a car is coming in my blind spot or if I try to signal over. Um, and I really like that thing because sometimes when I'm driving at night when I have really tinted windows I can't see when the car is directly beside me uh, because the tint's really dark So just to have that extra safety uh, is something that I really love And just in case in the winter man if I want to Come out in the vehicle and warm my butt up. I got heated seats here. What's that? Oh Love the illumination that this vehicle has Wow, and you also have a wireless charging pad which Let's take my phone. Let's drop it in there. Boom. So just in case I forget my charger at the house, I do have an option to wirelessly charge my phone. Alright, these seats are getting hot. And just the uh, have navigation. Because sometimes I use Apple CarPlay, but if I don't want to use it, I do have a choice to have navigation. Um, and then you have Blue Link, which is uh Hyundai's Kia Connect. Um, and just to have all of these features, and what's the price? What kind of price we have? We have thirty-one thousand dollars. Thirty-one thousand dollars for all of this. You got cars that are that uh, you pay double the price just for the same features, you know. And sometimes I feel like you pay the price for a name, but the warranty isn't as close to the warranty that's on this. You know, um, this vehicle is fantastic. You know, I would not mind using this as a daily driver uh, to commute back and forth to work because. I mean, what, what, what am I going to miss out on, you know? I got my all-wheel drive. I got my warranty. I got my wireless phone charger. I got my heated seats. I got my navigation. I mean, what else would you need in the vehicle plus my sunroof? I mean, sunroof, I don't really care sometimes about having a sunroof, but in the summer when it's really hot and I don't feel like using my AC, um, I love to roll down my windows and enjoy the, the fresh air, the breeze, and just to have that just is a plus for me. Um, so that's gonna be your five reason why you guys should own this vehicle um, All right guys, I'm gonna catch you in the next video. I don't want to I didn't want to make this video too long I just wanted to show you guys the room and space that you have in this vehicle Plus the reason why I think you guys should own this vehicle if it's a vehicle that you would consider in purchasing And if you check the link down below um, I'm also gonna have the POV drive in this vehicle um, Right now. I know I've been getting asked this question a lot uh, right now. It's kind of hard for me to do nighttime videos uh, because I have things to do at the work, but when the daytime switches as like daylight savings, um, I will be having a lot more nighttime videos for you guys because I know you guys want to see what these videos or how these videos are performing at night. Um, so just stay tuned for that. Uh, it should be in the next month, month and a half. And just thank you guys who've been subscribing, thank you guys for watching the videos, and I will catch you guys in the next video.